How are you guys doing this evening? My name is Josh Sloan. I'm the campus pastor at Generations North Church. This is a new plant by Bigsby Fruel Baptist Church, and we will be launching October 3rd. Man, it's coming so quickly. We are so excited as we're moving forward to see what God will do and already be rejoicing in what He is doing. It's so exciting, such an exciting time right now. The replant team and our sending church, we've been quoting Ephesians 3, 20 through 21 this entire time that says, now to him who is able to do above and beyond all that we ask or think according to the power that works in us, to him be glory in the church and in Christ Jesus to all generations forever and ever, amen. And we know that we cannot do this without the power of God that works in us. We know that we're not able to do this without him. As one of our team leaders likes to point out to us and remind us of this awesome truth, that if we could do it on our own, it wouldn't be from God. Right now, we know that this is from God because it's amazing, it's exceedingly abundant what we can imagine or think. He's already doing these amazing things. An example, something to praise about and rejoice. We replaced the roof on our parsonage, which we're trying to sell. And as we were doing that, we found a wonderful offer that was almost half of what we had budgeted for and expected. But as well, when the roofer ordered the supplies, they went to the person that they, the supplier, and they said that we actually don't have that grade. So they upgraded them from a 10 year roof to a 40 year. And it's so exciting. God is doing these amazing things. And I want to rejoice in you, with you, as much as I am asking for your prayer. Because, man, God is already showing up in an amazing way. He's bringing people into our path that we're hoping and praying for that will come and join us as we move into Generations North. Man, the team that God has brought together for this is wonderful people who love God and are excited about Generations North. He's already doing amazing things. And I think he's given me a verse, Proverbs 16, 3, that says, Commit your activities to the Lord, and your plans will be established. And we know that this is his plan. We're surrendering our will to him, and we're allowing his plan to be established here. We're committing all we are to him. To paraphrase A.W. Tozer, as we move into a time of prayer. Prayer is not asking God to surrender to our will, but surrendering our will to God. And as we move into this time of prayer, that is what I'm praying for myself and the team, that as we are praying to God to do exceedingly abundant what we can imagine or think, that we're surrendering our will for Him, for His vision for this church to come into reality, not our own, but His. So as we move into this time of prayer, as you guys know, we're moving this Wednesday night at 6.30 about just giving you guys some specific prayer requests that we're gonna ask you to join us, to be praying about, there's going to be a mixture of things for Generations North as well for main campus. So the first thing that we ask you guys to continually be praying for, we have, we've been asking for the last two weeks, is to sell the parsonage. God is doing amazing things here, and it looks like it is almost to completion. But we need your prayer that God will just be guiding the people's hands as we are finishing the last documents, as the person who is inquiring about it, they get all their documents ready, and that will be a quick transaction, and that God, again, will do above and beyond all we can imagine or think. And it seems like that. We said that we wanted 180000 and that's basically what he's given us if this goes through. So that's something to rejoice in. Secondly, we want to be praying for our outreach team. Right now, they're meeting, and we're going to be focusing on planning events and outreach to the community that is focusing on just ministering to people. Because we we just don't want to be about building the kingdom of Generations North or Bigsby Thrill Baptist Church. We want to bring God's kingdom on earth as it is in heaven. So part of outreach is not just getting people to come join us on Sunday, but it's ministering to them, bringing them to the throne of God, and having them become a part of the family of God. So if you be, as you're praying for these outreach events, be praying that God brings people who need to hear his word to us so that we can minister to them, show them the gospel, his love, his righteousness, his mercy, point to the gospel of God and bring them to him. Be praying that God is already preparing the hearts of those we encounter to be softened to his message. We also need to be praying, we are asking that 
God to provide 50 volunteers for our preview services leading into our uh, launch service on October 3rd. So we need 50 volunteers. That seems like a lot, but we know God can do it. So be praying for that, for that 50 volunteers that God is already preparing the hearts again of those people to join us. And in that, be praying for our three preview services and our launch services. Starting in July, the last Sunday of each month will be a preview service in July, August, and September, which these are gonna be focused on bringing people in and having them just become part of the church as we move into our launch. And then our launch service is October 3rd. It seems like it's a long way away, but it's not as long as you think. It's just the summer away. So I'll be already be praying for these events. As we move into main campus needs, remember to be praying for the hurting families right now who have lost some loved ones. I'm not gonna say their names here. But you guys know who they are if you're part of our church. If you don't, just be praying for hurting families here. There's a lot of hurting families right now due to the losses from COVID. Just be praying that the great comforter, God the comforter, just wrap his arms around them. Be praying that in this, that main campus, Bigsby Thrill Baptist Church, is strengthened as we move into this plan. That is one of our biggest things that we know God will do, that both these churches will be strengthened as we move forward because we're doing God's will and God honors and blesses those who do His will. Church, I'm so excited about what we're doing and what God is doing. We're so excited. And again, if you want to be part of it, go to the URL, join our prayer group, but also, if you have any specific prayer requests that we can be praying for you about, go to either one of our websites, Bigsby Fuel Baptist Church, uh, Bigsby FWB dot church, Generations North dot church, and both those home pages we have prayer request buttons. We're so excited! We're so excited to see what God is going to do. And as much as we're asking your prayer for us, we want to join you. Have a wonderful Wednesday evening. Enjoy your families. And I'm so excited to see you Sunday.